डबल एंगल फार्मूलाए डबल एंगल फार्मूलाए आर यूज टू कन्वर्ट द डबल एंगल इन टू सिंगल एंगल टू थीटा टू वन थीटा जनरली वी यूज डबल एंगल फार्मूलाए टू कन्वर्ट डबल एंगल इन टू सिंगल एंगल वेल वी कैन ओनली मेक चेंजेस इन द एंगल्स वी कैन नॉट चेंज द कोफिशेंट्स दिस इज द डबल एंगल फार्मूला ऑफ साइन थीटा सी साइन फोर थीटा इज टू साइन टू थीटा कॉस टू थीटा the double angle means the double of this angle the double of 2 is 4 the formula of sin 2 theta is 2 sin 1 theta cos 1 theta and the double of this angle is here so if you go in this way the angle is double and if you will go in this way the angle is half and these two angles are same so this is the formula of sin 2 theta 2 sin theta cos theta and the double of this angle is here and sin 4 theta is 2 sin 2 theta cos 2 theta this is the double of this angle and the half is here so sin 3 theta will be 2 sin 3 upon 2 theta and cos 3 upon 2 theta if you go in this way the angle is double if you go in this way the angle is half you have to learn this formula and you you must know how to change the formula for the other angles like for 4 theta for 6 theta like this you can only make changes in angles you cannot change the coefficients the product of sin theta and cos theta from sin 2 theta formula this is the डबल एंगल फार्मूला ऑफ साइन टू थीटा साइन टू थीटा इज टू साइन थीटा कॉस थीटा सो वी कैन ईजिली मेक दिस प्रोडक्ट सब्जेक्ट फ्रॉम दिस फार्मूला सो वैन वी विल मेक दिस प्रोडक्ट सब्जेक्ट वी विल गेट साइन टू थीटा अपॉन टू विच इज हेयर सी द डबल ऑफ दिस एंगल इज हेयर दिस एंगल इज वन एंड दिस एंगल इज टू सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू राइट द फार्मूला फॉर साइन टू थीटा एंड कॉस टू थीटा the double of this angle should be here sin 4 theta upon 2 must understand these angles uh, ratios relations of these angles cos 2 theta well there are three formula for cos 2 theta and are used according to the given situations number 1 cos 2 theta cos 2 theta is 2 cos square 1 theta minus 1 the double of this angle is here this is the first formula of cos 2 theta this is cos theta in terms of cos theta so the double angle is here this is here cos 2 theta is 2 cos square 1 theta minus 1 the double of this angle is here and if you will go in this way the angle will be half so you can uh, write the formula for 4 theta as well so cos 4 theta will be 2 cos square 2 theta minus 1 because this angle is double and in this way the angle is half this is the second formula of cos 2 theta these are all three formulas this is in terms of cos theta this is in terms of sin theta and this is in terms of cos theta and sin theta cos 2 theta is 1 minus 2 sin square 1 theta the double of this angle is here and in this way the angle is half so this second formula is here this is the first formula and this is the second formula cos 2 theta in terms of sin theta this is 1 minus 2 sin square 1 theta the double of this angle is here and if you will go in this way the angle will be half
and you can also write this formula for cos 4 theta it should be 1 minus 2 sine square 2 theta in this way angle is double in this way angle is half if you want to write the formula for cos 6 theta you can 1 minus 2 sine square 3 theta the half angle should be here so this is the first formula and this is the second formula now the third formula this is the third formula cos 2 theta in terms of both cos and sin theta the double of this angle is here and the half of this angle is here and these two angles are same so cos 2 theta is cos square theta minus sin square theta you can also write this formula for cos 4 theta it should be cos square 2 theta minus sin square 2 theta half angle should be here half of 4 is 2 and the double of 2 is 4 so these are three formulas formulas of uh, cos 2 theta you must learn all these three formula cos 2 theta is 2 cos square 1 theta minus 1 cos 2 theta is 1 minus 2 sin square 1 theta and cos 2 theta is cos square 1 theta minus sin square 1 theta tan 2 theta see this is the double angle formula of tan 2 theta it is 2 tan 1 theta 1 minus tan square 1 theta the double of this angle is here and the half of this angle is here therefore tan 6 theta will be tan 2 theta when 2 is here the half angle is here so when 6 is here the half of 6 should be here So tan 2 tan 3 theta 1 minus tan square 3 theta. I explained this relation here. If you go in this way, the angle is double. And if you will go in this way, from left to right, the angle will be half. The half of 2 is 1. For tan 4 theta, you should write 2 tan 2 theta. The half of this angle should be here and here. well uh, use all double angle formula to convert even angle into one angle like 2 theta into 1 theta or 4 theta into 1 theta but when we have 2 theta then we have to use double angle formula one once and when we have 4 theta then we have to use double angle formula twice because 4 theta first will convert into 2 theta and then 2 theta will convert into 1 theta now the next topic cos square theta to convert power 2 into power 1 we need cos square theta see this is the double angle formula of cos 2 theta so we can easily make we can easily make cos square theta subject from this formula so cos square 1 theta if you will make this thing subject you will get 1 plus cos 2 theta upon 2 see the angle relation the double of this angle is here so if you want to write formula for cos square 2 theta then this angle will be double of this angle we use uh, these formulas in integration when we will integrate uh, cos square 2 theta in integration we would need uh, these formulas we won't integrate cos square 2 theta we will integrate 1 plus cos 4 theta upon 2. So these formulas are very important for integration of cos square theta and cos square 2 theta. Now sin square theta. So we can easily make sin square theta from this formula. For that we need to bring this on left side and this on right side. So sin square theta is 1 minus cos 2 theta upon 2 and the double of this angle is here therefore sine square 2 theta will be 1 minus cos 4 theta upon 2 if you will compare these two formulas then you will see that there is just one difference which is the sine so for cos square theta the formula is 1 plus cos 2 theta upon 2 
and for sin square theta the formula is same except the sign here the sign is positive and here the sign is negative so you can easily learn this formula and with the help of this formula you can learn this formula so this formula can easily be uh, learned through this formula I already have discussed this thing the power 2 to power 1 conversions double angle formula are used to convert power 2 into power 1 we have done this cos square theta is 1 plus cos 2 theta upon 2 whereas sin square theta is 1 minus cos 2 theta upon 2 examples express cos 4 theta in terms of cos 1 theta see i told you we will use double angle formula twice to convert 4 theta into 1 theta because first we will convert 4 theta into 2 theta and then we will convert 2 theta into 1 theta therefore we have to use double angle formula twice since we need our answer in terms of cos theta so we will use the cos theta form of double angle of cos 2 theta so cos 2 theta is 2 cos square theta minus 1 we can also write this formula for cos 4 theta the angle is half here the half of 2 is 1 so the formula for cos 4 theta will be 2 cos square 2 theta minus 1 the half angle of 4 is here now uh, you have to write cos square 2 theta as cos 2 theta whole square you can do this you can write this power as a whole power to make the calculation simple now you have to use double angle formula here this is the first time we use double angle formula here and this is the second time we are using double angle formula since our, we need our answer in terms of cos theta so again we have to use the cos theta form of cos 2 theta which is this so cos 2 theta is 2 cos square theta minus 1 now we have to expand this expansion by means of a minus b whole square formula so we'll get this thing by simplifying this we have the answer cos 2 4 theta in terms of cos 1 theta this uh, example is very important to prove the identities of cos 4 theta the next example express cos 4 theta in terms of sine theta again we have to use double angle formula twice i mean 4 theta will be converted into 2 theta first and then 2 theta will be converted into 1 theta but since we need our answer in, in terms of sine theta to at the second time we will use sine theta form of cos 2 theta but uh, for first time or at the first time use cos theta so whether you are converting cos 4 theta into cos 1 theta or cos 4 theta into sine theta at first time always use this formula the cos theta form See, this is the common step for both the uh, questions to make the calculation simple we do this so cos 4 theta is 2 cos square 2 theta minus 1 first time always use cos theta form now bring this to here make this two as the whole power since we need our answer in terms of sine theta therefore we have to use sine theta form of cos 2 theta here which is 1 minus 2 sine square theta now we just need to expand this and then we need to simplify this that's the final answer now we will use uh, this technique to prove this identity we have to show this this is the complicated side so by taking left hand side we have this see cos 4 theta can be written as 2 cos square 2 theta minus 1 here we have to use double angle formula once so straight away use sine theta form because you need your answer in terms of sine theta 
Now write this cos square two theta as cos two theta whole square as we did here. Now use the sine theta form of cos two theta here. This is important because we need our answer in terms of sine theta. So must use sine theta form. So at the second time, always use sine theta form of cos two theta if you need your answer in terms of sine theta. So one minus two sine square theta whole square. Now we just need to simplify this, expand this, and just simplify this entire thing to get the answer. So if you know the concept, this concept, you can easily prove uh, this type of identity. The next question: Solve this equation for this domain. See, we have this angle is one, so this is fine, but this angle is two, so we have to convert this two into one. And since this function is uh, sine theta, therefore we must use sine theta form of cos two theta here. So by using sine theta form of cos two theta here, we have this. Now we can easily solve this equation. We need to bring everything on left side and then we need to factorize this and you all know how to solve these equations. Sign is positive so it must be in first and second quadrant. This is the answer of first quadrant and this is the answer of second quadrant. Sign theta minus 1 is when theta is 270. So these are the final answers. Make sure you must use sine theta form of double angle here to convert the entire equation into sine theta form. The next topic, sum of 